Hi guys, it's Ariana. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we are doing a hair dyeing video on another Overtone color. So I got the Extreme Green from Overtone and I'm really excited. So it is very, very green. It looks like this. <laughs> It is a really, really deep green and I'm excited for that. When I looked on the website, it said that on my natural root area, it should dye it. So I'm hoping that it does. I don't know if it's actually going to, but we're gonna try anyway. But as you guys can see, the green that I originally had on my hair that I got down at the salon has faded to this kind of teal color and I'm not really into it. So I'm going to dye my hair green today. So. We are going to try out the Overtone Extreme Green and see if it works. So I'm just gonna throw on some gloves. We do get gloves in the Overtone kit. I'll post on the screen here what the total is. I don't remember what the total price is. I would say that it is fairly expensive considering I live in Canada and I have to ship it to me and the conversion and all that. It's not very inexpensive. It is actually expensive dye, but I do think that it works really well. So I'm excited to see if the green works because the last one that I tried, which was the silver. It did work, but because my hair wasn't light enough, it didn't really work as I wanted it to, but it still worked, and the orange worked really, really well. So I'll post those videos in the eye if you guys are interested in seeing those, but because my hair is already kind of a blue color, I'm assuming the green will work really well. So I have my gloves on. I'm sorry if the mic catches the noise that the gloves make. It's kind of annoying, but it is what it is. But I'm just going to see if this stuff works without making too much of a mess in my studio. So I don't really <laughs> dye my hair professionally at all, so bear with me. I'm just dyeing my hair like I would any type of dye at home, and I have no training in dyeing my hair, so if you guys don't like the way I dye my hair, I am not a hairstylist, so bear with me. But I'm just gonna go ahead and dye my hair. So this is a conditioning color treatment. So it is going to color my hair while also do an extreme deep treatment. So I'm really excited for that. I'm just hoping that I don't run out of the dye this time. I know with the silver, I kind of went a little bit hard at the beginning with the color and I started to run out near the end. So I'm gonna try to spread out the color as best as I can without running into running out of it because I didn't buy two because it's really expensive. <laughs> As you can see, I am coating it into the root, so my natural growth, because I do want that to have a green tint to it. So, so far it's going on really well. It smells really good, it smells like mint, and I haven't used very much of it, so I think I will have enough this time as long as I section properly and spread it out better. But so far it's going on really good, and I haven't had any issues. The color is really pretty, so I'm very excited for that. So the bottom half of my hair is done. As you guys can see, it is really messy. I'm not the most clean person when it comes to dyeing my hair. I have it all over my arms, I have it all over my neck, I have it all over my face in <laughs> this side here. So definitely wear something that you don't care if you get dye on or something that will easily remove the dye if you do get it on, but I would say it's very messy. <laughs> so keep that in mind.
Okay, so I have finished dyeing my hair. So I used the majority of the tub. So there is just a little bit left. It's just gonna be enough that if I missed a couple pieces that I can coat those pieces in this the next time that I wash my hair. But I would say if you have fairly thick hair and fairly long hair like I do, you may want to buy two of them. I know it is fairly expensive though, like I said, so that's why I only ever buy one. I can usually get away with just using one tub and my hair is usually okay, <laughs> but I may have missed some spots, so that's why I like to keep a little bit extra left over so that if I did miss anything, I can just go over it quickly while I'm in the shower. But, wear gloves. <laughs> so you can get the overtone daily conditioner like with it. The only problem with that is I found that it dyed my hands and <laughs> my skin every time that I tried using it. So they recommend that you use gloves when you're using their products. But when I'm in the shower and I'm just doing a daily conditioner, I don't have gloves. So I found that those products didn't really work for me. They were just kind of a pain in the ass. So there is stuff that you can buy to help keep the color in your hair, like I said, but they're kind of a pain in the ass because they dye your skin. <laughs> when I dyed my hair bright orange, I had orange hands for like a week. It was hilarious because I didn't use the gloves. <laughs> but I'm gonna leave this on my hair for about 45 minutes. It says to leave on for 10 to 15 minutes, but I always push these products to the absolute max because I like to have super colorful hair and I don't think 10 to 15 minutes will really do it for me. So I'm gonna leave it on for about 45 minutes and then I will come back on here once it is washed and styled and we can see what the color looks like. But so far, it is a really, really pretty green. I'm really excited and I really hope that my roots took the color because if they're a deeper green than the rest of my hair, I think that'll be really pretty. So I'm gonna go hang out for the next 45 minutes and then I will see you guys then. All right, so I am back after rinsing out the green dye out of my hair and this is the color that I got. So it is this really gorgeous green, shamrock green color. It's super pretty. So as you guys can see, it did dye my roots. So if you guys do have light blonde hair, you can definitely use an extreme color on it and it will dye it, so that's really cool. I really like the color that I got. The color is absolutely stunning. It's kind of like this emerald green and I am in love with it. I absolutely love having green hair. I'm really hoping that this doesn't fade to a blue like the last green that we put on my hair did because I didn't really want teal hair and I definitely didn't want blue hair. So I'm hoping this fades to a light green, but you never know, it might fade to blue. But this is super stunning. It definitely worked. It's very, very, very green. It was an extreme green and that's exactly what I got. So I'm really, really happy for that. So I used the majority of the tub. So like I said, if you do have long or thick hair similar to mine, you may want to get two of them just because it does soak up a lot of the product really quickly. So it is a conditioner. So my hair feels absolutely amazing. It's super hydrated. It's super silky. It feels great. So I have absolutely no complaints with this color. This color worked really well. This is the extreme green. So I obviously wanted to have very, very vibrant green hair and that is what I got. So the last time that I did an extreme color on my hair, which was the extreme orange. I had it for about three months. My hair didn't really fade too drastically for about two to three months. So I will say that the extreme colors work really well and I'm hoping that this lasts about two months or so. So I will do a separate video checking in later on, probably about two months from now and let you guys know what my color of my hair faded to because I'm really interested to see what it fades to and how the overtone green works because obviously the last video that I did showing the green that I did. It only lasted about three weeks and it faded really fast and it faded to a teal color. So I'm really hoping that doesn't happen with the Overtone brand because if it doesn't fade too drastically and it doesn't fade to a color that I don't like, then this is going to be the color that I continue to use just because the Joyco one clearly didn't work that well for me. So I will say that I'm incredibly impressed with this. My hair turned out super gorgeous. It's super green. It's super pretty. Like it is stunning. Love this color. So I'm very impressed. I hope you guys did enjoy watching me dye my hair. I hope you guys are enjoying these hair styling, hair dyeing, hair coloring videos. And I hope you guys are just enjoying my channel in general. If you guys did like this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below for more content like this. And I will see you guys at the next video. Bye.